Alrighty. Woo, YouTube, it is cold here. It is staying <coughs> about 30 degrees, right below freezing. Um, thought I'd do a rabbit update. A lot of changes here. <coughs> this one's been the last couple videos, but I haven't finished it yet. I got the what's there besides the roof from a neighbor. He was going to build them one and then decided not to. So I'm going to turn that into about a two or three pin grow out pin where I can put the babies into. Um, is what that'll eventually be. But I've just been busy and it's been cold other than that. Um, here's this pin here. I think it all has all New Zealand's in it right now. Um, this is Zoe. A broken, uh, heavy broken red New Zealand. This is her litter over here of six week olds. Five or six week olds. They're still little bitties. Um, seven, there's four, four boys, no, there's five girls and three boys, but one of them, this one right here, is not hers. It was from another litter, if you remember the Mini Rex litter. She's half Mini Rex, half Red New Zealand. The rest are pure Red New Zealands. Here's a young doe that's about to be bred, a Red New Zealand that I raised. Here's the one that just got done raising the 13, or not just got done, she's getting fattened back up before I breed her back. And then here is that, uh, a, a new... Sound. Don't know what it was. I don't th I think it's okay. But um, here's uh, another red pedigreed red New Zealand. Alrighty. Now this is kind of turning to the the buck cage here. This is my red broken buck. He's young. He's about four and a half months old, five months old. Uh, start breeding him in a month or so. Here's my um, uh, Gus Gus. Is my uh, uh, try buck and he's not old enough to breed yet he's about four months old give him a little bit longer uh, my new bucks uh, a lot of new rabbits you're about to see uh, my new bucks are right here this is a caster uh, this is a caster out of a try he's about a one year old and this is a blue out of a rural ride white and a broken blue and so and I did get a contract with another um, uh, establishment to sell pet rabbits. So, um, about to get a lot more rabbits. Y'all will be able to see all the pet rabbits again. Uh, I have the mats to go on these ordered. Um, just trying to get them here. But I will have I will have the mats that go in here. I usually use boards and stuff. But since I'm getting so many, hey, Mama Hen, I'm going to just order mats for them. So, I will have those in the future. Here's two little red and broken reds. Uh... It's cold here, and you can tell they're cold. But that's two out of the the first litter I had of six. The does are in the barn. I'll show you. All righty, inside the barn we go. Like I told you, a lot of changes. All righty, and here we have the two litters of babies. This is the uh, uh, broken lilac with her seven babies, and this is the chocolate. Can't see her in the dark, and her seven babies. And they're growing like weeds. Uh, these three girls over here are new. This is a blue eyed, um, blue eyed mini rex, otter mini rex. Um, here is a black mini rex and a black mini rex. I've got both of these, and uh, the uh, I had a brain fart. Both of these are out of a try doe also. I'm not a fond of black, but um, I, since they're out of a try, I want to bring them back to the try and see. So we have that, and yes, all this is new. I have six cages in here, and uh, what will be in the near future is I'm going to make a rabbit barn right straight out from behind this pen right here. Uh, it'll be uh, 10 by 30, and cages on both sides. But well, that's future. This is now. Um, I got some laying hens. I moved them into here uh, because it's just too cold outside. I'm going to see if I can get my egg production up. Uh, we have six holes in here, and then we have this little buck rabbit that I got on one of the deals. And I'll show you the other one I got with him. He was supposed to be a little girl, um, but I didn't have the heart to send him back to the people that had him. Uh, so he's just a wild rabbit. He just he goes in and out with the chickens. Um, this is the mini rex that had the litter. 
the Tri Mini Rex that I kept one of her does out in that other pen. This is a new line head, um, and she's bred to the Dutch Buck, which I'll show you in a minute. Uh, this is the Young Blue Mini Rex. She's only about four and a half months, so I'll give her another month or so before I breed her. And this is a Lilac uh, Mini Rex doe. Say hi, everybody. Fatty, fat, fat. And she just bred to the Caster, um, Caster Buck. All right, these are the three uh, Broken Red New Zealands that I have left. Uh, but I keep a couple of them and sell one of them. This is that mixed little doe that I have, and I'm not sure. I'm going to breed her, but I need a cage space to put her in, so she's just in there for a while. She gets out and runs around, but she's a spool brat, so we have to keep her pinned up or she tries to get out of everything. Yeah. And right now she's in heat, but she's too young. But she thinks she thinks she's something. <laughs> she thinks she's something but she's gonna be a pretty mama uh but like i said i did get a contract for pet type rabbits so all these uh new zealands will be bred or all the mixed new zealands will be bred to uh mainly mini rex to get a nice pet size rabbit a medium size rabbit um and have good litter size all righty last one all right all these down on the ground are young does I rescued, really, but I'm going to use them as breeders in the future. But they came out of a, a bad situation. It was a little bitty wooden hutch. I hate wooden hutches. People give me a hard time about wooden hutches and um, or about wire. And, man, there's nothing worse than seeing a rabbit on a wooden hutch. They all stunk, and their feet were all yellow and having open sores on them from all be, be, having to sit in their urine. But they're doing fine in here on the floor. As soon as I have cage space, they'll all be separated out because they're almost ready to – these four are almost ready to uh, – the smaller ones are almost ready to breed. This one here is younger. She's about three months old. She's going to be a big rabbit. I can tell by her bones. But um, i got to fatten her up. I don't. She wasn't taken care of. She, she's in the worst shape. Here's the uh, steel – uh, whatever you want to call it, mini rex doe I had, uh, and she's poor because she's raising a litter of eight, so I'll give her a break after she raises them. Um, this is the uh, chinchilla mini rex, um, and she's only raising four, so she'll get bred back pretty fast. She didn't lose any of her weight at all. Uh, this is a new one that came with the ones off the floor. This is a Harley, and uh, for Harlequin, and um, I'm going to breed her to that caster mini rex since that caster has a try for a mom. And see if I can pull some cool colors out of that. Um, but she's a good looking doe. She's actually the picture I saw of her when I went to the place and got the rest of these. Um, this broken here and that broken when she gets better is going to be good rabbits. These here are going to be, uh, they're duchess. This one has a, a little bit of a band, but these two turned out solid black. But I have this Dutch blue buck right here. And I per, uh, purchased him with the... Uh, um, uh, give me a minute with that other little buck that's running around on the ground um, but I was mainly going for this one and uh, he's house broken and everything but uh, usually if you get a dominant buck like this they're really good breeders and he is he's been a really good breeder but I'll breed him to all these Dutches and see if I can pull out some Dutches because uh, people like the Dutch um, and see if I can get that done but well that's the rabbits I have a lot more than I did and I'll have a lot more in the future than I do now um, by this spring, I need to be, uh, I need to be producing quite a few, um, but that is the new pins and the new rabbits, um, up to, I think, 28 does and 7 bucks, and I gotta cycle out a couple bucks when I figure out which ones are the best breeders, um, and that'll just be, uh, in the future, but, <laughs> see him, I'll uh, see him, I don't know if you can see him, he just came in and I'm gonna go in that, go eat that food out of that pen. <laughs> Look at him going in there. <laughs> oh my goodness! Actually, I'm gonna shut him in here if he'll stay in here. That'd be a good pen for him. That wouldn't have to worry about him breeding the, breeding the does, and then I could get him out when I need to. Yeah, no, I let him out. He's a good rabbit. Go on, Bubba. We'll eventually probably eat him or I'll sell him for a pet. But that's the rabbits. I got all this cleaned up here. Um, but just everything doing good here. About to have a 
about to have a lot more rabbits um, and mainly breeding for pets, which is great because I can experiment with different colors and get different stuff. I always have my pedigreed reds separate, uh, be breeding them separate, but um, uh, right now it'll be a a, uh, a mix a mix rabbit that I'll be going for a mini rex Dutch line head mix, um, going mainly for the coloring and the uh, cuteness rather than a certain breed. But alrighty, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.